In this video, I'm going to show you six handheld camera moves that's going to give your footage that silky smooth look without gimbals, tripods, or sliders. It's coming up. Hey everyone, Steve here from Learn Online Video, helping you master the art of online video production. And today I'm in the north of France inside these ancient ruins. And I'm gonna show you six handheld camera moves that anyone can do. A Couple of things just before we start. Number one, use a camera strap for this. When pulled tight, it creates tension and gives you extra stability in your shots. Also, if you have either a camera with in-body stabilization or an image stabilized lens, use that to iron out any unwanted shakes. Okay, here we go. Camera move number one is the side lunge. For this, we're going to lunge either left or right to replicate a slider shot. This move is perfect for reveals and works best when you have something in the foreground of your shot. Once you've mastered this move, try pulling focus mid-lunge to take it to the next level. Now remember, for all of these shots, keep your camera strap pulled tight for extra stability. Okay, number two and a particular favorite of mine, the jib shot. For this, we're going to bend our knees, crouch down, and in one smooth movement, slowly stand up. Just like shot one, this is most effective with something in the foreground. This shot can add serious production value to your videos as it mimics a crane shot, otherwise known as a jib. And look, hey, extra tip here, okay? Once you've shot this footage and brought it into your editing software, don't be afraid to use post-stabilization. If you're in Final Cut, use stabilization. If you're in Premiere Pro, then use Warp Stabilizer. Don't be afraid, that's what these tools are there for. This is really gonna help iron out any shakes in your footage and give you a really, really smooth finish to your videos. Number three, a nice easy one, this one, the Parallax. Minor lunging involved with this one. We're going to simultaneously lunge sideways whilst locking our camera on a fixed position. If you enable the grids on your camera, then use the center grid to keep your focal point in the center. Keep your movement as smooth and as fluid as possible. Okay, next up, a nice simple classic, the push forward or pull back. You can either lunge for this, or if you're feeling particularly brave, then try walking. This can add a really cinematic feel to your videos, so it's a great one to have in the arsenal. Okay, finally, this can really add to your videos when used correctly, the rotate. You can shoot this going forwards or backwards. Find a focal point, put it in the center of your frame, and rotate your camera whilst pushing forwards or backwards. An unusual maneuver, this one, but it can really help your videos stand out. So there you have it, six camera movements, all shot handheld that anyone can do. And look, we're really just scratching the surface of what's possible shooting handheld. If you'd like me to delve a little bit deeper and do more tutorials and break down a few more handheld shooting techniques, then do let me know in the comments section below. And if you found this video useful, let me know by hitting the old thumbs up button. But that's it from me. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.